If you're a small YouTube channel and you're not getting any views on your videos yet, you're gonna wanna try these five things and I promise you it's gonna help you get more views on YouTube today. And the best part is these are free things that you can do inside of the YouTube app that you probably aren't doing yet. The first thing you can do to instantly get more views is to go to your long form videos and then remix these into shorts. And right here, I'm gonna show you how to do this on your phone. You're gonna see this little shorts logo and this is only gonna work on your own YouTube video. Videos. So make sure you're logged in and then you're going to be able to see this and you click that remix button and you can see you have a few options here. The one you want to use is the edit into a short option and then you have two different options. You can either use a 15 second short or you can use a 60 second short. Now that I selected that 60 in the top right hand corner, I can extend this to make it as long as I want and then I can drag this around to choose a different part of the video and then you can even move this to the left and right to make sure it looks all good. You'll want to hit next and then from here, this is where you can add in some text, you can add in some sound effects, a voiceover, different things to kind of spice up that YouTube short. Once you remix that video, you can add in a title and then you can post this onto your account and this is going to post just like any normal short would go onto your channel. This is exactly what I did when I started my YouTube channel with zero subscribers a few months ago, and this helped me get a few hundred and a few thousand views within those first 28 days. Now, don't be surprised if you get a huge spike of views within that first hour and then it kind of tapers off. This is very normal because YouTube is pushing shorts heavy right now, and so they're trying to get a lot of people to see different shorts and to see new shorts, and so this is kind of free views that you can utilize right now while YouTube is promoting more shorts. The second strategy that you should be doing to help you get more views is to pin comment a link to a new video on your channel. What you wanna do is add some text explaining what the video is, maybe just even the title of the video, and then you're gonna add in that link to that comment, pin it, and then a lot of people are gonna see this and more people are going to click on that link and go watch another one of your videos. So instead of just having one view on one video, if they watch two videos, you get twice as many views. This video was brought to you by Elgato. Elgato creates amazing solutions and products for content creators, live streamers, and gamers. And one of their newest offerings is the Elgato Facecam Pro, which is an amazing plug and play webcam that'll get you professional looking videos. And it's actually the first 4K60 webcam giving you a really high quality image for your live streams, video conference calls, and even gaming. When you compare the image that this webcam produces as that's what you're looking at right now, it just looks superior to other traditional webcams, which is really awesome. But what's cool about this camera is it, it's easy to use, but when you download their free camera hub software that comes with this webcam, you can actually unlock some potential of this webcam and change things like the zoom of your webcam, the focus settings, the exposure, and so much more. And I actually love that this webcam has autofocus. So if you hold up a product, it'll focus on the product. And if you drop it down, it'll focus back on your face, making it an awesome upgrade to your current webcam solution. And if you wanna check out the Facecam Pro for yourself, check out the link in the description below. Thank you, Elgato, for sponsoring this video. The third thing you can do to boost more views is posting onto your community tab with links in that post to send to your videos. Keep in mind, you do need 500 subscribers to unlock this feature, but once you get this feature, you should definitely utilize it. There's a lot of different options you can do when it comes to polls or images or just text on these posts. And what we found that works best through different experiments on Think Media is when you have posts that keep people on that community post for a long time. So whether you want to write out a bit of a little mini blog inside of there, or you want to add in multiple images in these types of posts, this is where we've seen the most amount of views and people actually want to read what is on that post. Now, this is good exposure to your channel, no matter what. And even people who aren't subscribed to your channel could see these community posts, which is pretty cool. But you also want to be adding your video link in there as well. So if people see it, they can click on it and go watch one of your videos and it'll help you kind of get more views going in the right direction. The fourth thing you can do is to utilize playlists on YouTube. Now, what you'll notice these days is there's actually a clickable text above the title that is blue. And if you click on that, it's going to take you to a playlist, which is a pretty cool feature. Now you can post the playlist link in the description or in the pinned comment. And the goal with this is that you get someone to watch one video in your playlist and they watch another one of your videos and another and another and another and another. 
that was probably too many. So make sure that you're just not making playlists for the fun of making a playlist, but you're actually being very strategic with what videos are inside of there and even the title of this playlist. Now, if you do this effectively, you are gonna see a major spike in views, not just because instead of someone watching one video, they watch four, but also because when people are watching four of your videos back to back, YouTube takes this as a really good sign and in return is gonna start recommending your content to new people. Now, now the fifth way that you can get more views on YouTube, and this one is my absolute favorite, it's the transition method. And we've been using this method for a long time and running experiments, and we've seen actually views spike even on old videos and new videos when we use this method effectively. And if you wanna learn exactly how we've done this and how you can do this too, then click on the screen and watch that video, and I will see you guys in the next video.